anyway. Come along, I'll show you my ghoulery of artistic monster pieces. <laughs> now, here's the famous classic, Morning Lisa. <laughs> I can see how it's grown up, people. <laughs> Brrr, who painted that horrible thing? I can't make head or tail out of it. Vincent Van Gogh. He calls it self Portrait. Ah! <laughs> Here he comes now. Gee, he's much better looking at his pictures. <laughs> We've even got Goulahan interested in art. Hi, Gooly. What are you doing? I am posing for Bella. She's doing my portrait. A portrait of you? Haven't you ever heard of a finger painting? <laughs> I'm carving out a career as a sculptor myself. And this is my first project. Just needs one final touch. So it must be a listic pack. I'm glad it was a hit with you, too. It was. In fact, you inspired me. I want to be an artist, too. Well, how nice. Yeah, and I want to start by painting you, Drac. Really? <laughs> be my guest. Okay. 
I always thought you'd look better with purple. Speaking of purple, there's a purple crested meadow vulture. I want to report this to the bird watchers now. <laughs> What a bird is that? I should have known. It's a barn swallow. <laughs> Wowie my, there's a rare one. A tassel-tufted eagle. Make that a bald eagle. <laughs> Golly jeepers, a bird's nest with an egg in it. As a full-fledged bird watcher, it's my duty to return it. I better keep it warm till the mummy gets back. There's nothing worse than cold eggs. Uh-oh, here comes the mother now. <laughs> Well, golly cheapers, I was only trying to help out my baby. Man, I reckon that's what you'd call a booby hatch. <laughs> golly cheapers, who said being a father is for the birds? <laughs>
ghost where? Crypt sheets, man. Crypt sheets. Woo, 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 woo. Mary Casket, where do vampires sleep in Vienna? In Blue Danube Falls. I wonder what kind of bird is inside. Oh, a minor bird. Man, I just had my wolf wagon scare condition. Now when it sees a ghost, it folds itself up and hides in its own glove compartment with me. I wonder what kind of bird is inside. Oh, a stool pigeon. Hey, I just heard the abominable snowman has a pet dog. You know, it's a pup. Pickle. <laughs> I wonder what kind of bird is inside. Oh, an admiral bird. I should have warned you, the scalivator is very quick on the jaw. <laughs> I wonder what kind of bird is inside. Oh. It's a jailbird. <laughs> I need to that. Hello, Bella the Ghostly Spooking. Got a problem? Tell it to Bella Fella. Today's Ghost of Honor is from Erie, Transylvania. <laughs> what seems to be the problem? Well, I... That is... <laughs> Don't be shy. Well, my problem is that I'm, I'm supposed to haunt Hong Fu's Chinese laundry. So? Watch what happens when I try... No, say no! No, no, no! See what I mean? off the hook. <laughs> it's obvious Hong Fu needs glasses. Here, try these on. Bela, <laughs> <laughs> you're terrific. What kind of glasses did you give him? <laughs> Boo, vocals, what else? <laughs> Cooking up something special. Hi! Uh, Hagatha here with another wretched recipe straight from the witch's kitchen. <laughs> but first, let's see how our poltergeist Popo was uh, coming along. <laughs> <laughs> I only use the freshest poltergeist. <laughs> now, today's recipe is for the broomstick stew. And I must say it's sweeping the country. <laughs> First, we take any old broomstick that's flying around the house. Yoo-hoo! Broomhilda! <laughs> Add one medium-sized toad stool. Be careful to first remove the medium-sized toad. Needy, needy. You broke too if you got near that stew. Next, we add the usual spices. Scale of dragon, wing of bat, and tooth of newt. And most important, a pinch of Tabasco. Now we stir gently. <laughs> Looks like it's just about ready. <laughs> Try broomstick stew in your own home. It'll sweep you off your feet. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have given her a wave, but it looks like she already had one. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> it is the wolf wagon. The full moon has a strange effect on it. <laughs> and 
like his bite is even worse than his bark. <laughs> whoa, Wolf Wagon, whoa, baby. Get a grip on yourself. We have slipped his tank, but completely. I need help, man, but like who? Faster than a speeding ghoulie. More powerful than a local monster. Able to leap haunted houses in a single bound. <laughs> it's a weirdo. <laughs> it's a ding-a-ling. It's... Super Ghoul! Oh, I hope you're not just a flash in the pan, man. Never fear. I'll get your wolf wagon under control. Gotcha. Ooh, this bird's a regular lumberjerk. Ooh. Well, super cool. It is headed for a horrible haul. Fear not. My blinding speed will stop him. You know. <laughs> Never mind, pal. The full moon is gone, and the wolf wagon is back to normal. Woohoo! Thanks anyway, Super Ghoul. It was a good try. <laughs> good try, my foot. Look what you've done to Horrible Hall. Well, college apples. I was only trying to help Wolfie. <laughs> Hmm, you fixed his wagon. Now we're going to fix yours. <laughs> this week's guest group really stands out in a shroud. It's the spirit of 76. Man, now there's a group that's known from ghost to ghost. <laughs> Listen for the bells. Listen for the bells. Late at night, when everyone is sleeping, that is when the monsters come a creeping. Listen and you'll hear the bells ringing clear, calling all the ghouls from far and near. Listen. Everybody shout. Let the bells ring out. It's time for the ghoulies get together. Everybody shout. Let the bells ring out. It's time for the ghoulies get together.